Well, one of the challenges we have is our meter density is 2.6 meters per mile. It becomes a cost challenge to divvy up the cost of a mile line to just 2.6 customers. We're 2,500 mile co-op, so our size is pretty small. We have 23 employees. Those employees have to wear multiple hats for the functions that they do. It becomes a challenge to keep them educated in multiple areas to be able to back up other employees. The small utility product package the SUP. It allows members of a smaller size to take advantage of technology that they may not otherwise be able to get due to financial restrictions. The small utility productivity package has been a blessing for us both in a cost savings and a productivity. We were able to afford some of the modules that we were maybe on the fence as to whether we were going to get them or not but once we found out that we were able to bundle them with some of the other ones at a lower cost it was a no-brainer for us. We have been able to bundle eight different software packages. It saves us about $15,000 a year off of our NISC bill. But the greater savings that we achieve from that are the efficiencies that we get from those packages. My goal is to go in and treat a, any member as a member as a member. Our goal is to, to help them better serve their members and it allows them to reach out and, and offer their members the technology that they deserve despite where they live within the United States. With all of the programs that we have from NISC, and we are such a small co-op, we are finding options that the packages have that we are not utilizing. It's just a matter of learning what is all available to us and how we can utilize that to better serve our customers. Flint Hills has been with NISC since 1969, and when the board had made that decision, the expectation that they had was to use modern software to provide essential information to help operate our cooperative more effectively. And in 1969, NISC met that expectation of the board and continues to do so.